So remind me again why I'm making a video on Friday night about a prom that I'm not even going to. Um, because we need to cherish and document this wonderful, miraculous moment in our lives when me gets chosen for prom queen. Yes, it's gonna be great. You mean me? Right, this sounds super important. Not that I could be spending this night in any other productive way, maybe studying for SATs or writing my college applications essay. No, no, prom's a great way to spend it, especially when I'm not going. Of course it is. I mean, what better could you be doing making a documentary for people who are better than you, more popular than you? Oh god, I'm getting paid to spend a night with you morons, right? Of course not. No. I mean, so why would we be paying this not prom going little scrubby IT girl for making a much needed documentary? I mean, you should be honored to be making this movie for us. Right, honored. What do I get? Nothing. Nothing. Oh, we started. Mom. We're here with Taylor Grove the class president and resident queen bee at Larking Fields High School. So, Taylor, you're running for prom queen. That must be exciting. Yes, it's so exciting. It's like the most important thing of my entire life, except maybe getting into college and like finding a job, but that's more my parents' idea. But it's so exciting. Right. Wow. So you're the class president. Do you think that's going to increase your chance of winning? Oh, of course I think it will. I mean, the other people I'm competing up against are, like, dumb and stupid and sassy. But, like, I got it all figured out. I have my own campaign for being prom queen. And, of course, I had my own campaign for being class president. So, like, I know how this whole thing works. And, like, everybody loves me because I'm class president. Nice. Yeah, yes, everybody loves you. A little bit more enthusiastic, but you can cut that out. Right. So, Taylor, yeah, what are okay. your opinions on your so self-proclaimed best friends, Rebecca oh, friends. and Brittany? Oh, they're my best friends. Still a little bit more enthusiastic. Yeah, um, I would love for them to win, but I mean, like, not really, because I really want me to win. And, like, it'd mean the whole world to me, and I'd be, like, the most popular person in the world, and... It'd just be great. And, like, ah, oh, it'd be great. Um, yeah, I think that Rebecca's chance of winning is, like, zero. Yeah, she's not gonna win. She's... Stupid? She, she... She's... Superficial? Idiotic? Yeah, let's just leave it at that. Okay. And then, um, Brittany is just, like... <laughs> but, like... Salty, obnoxious, rude, yes. Okay, but I, I'm, like, a little bit sassy and, like, a little bit salty sometimes, but then I'm also, like, so smart and, like, ah, uh, so, uh, totally, I'm gonna win. But, yeah. Right. Let's not be too arrogant about it. Anyway, would you say that, you know all those times that someone made you really mad at school and so then you pretty much demolished their reputation, smashed it to pieces, and stomped on their heart with your little size six feet? Uh, it rings a bell. Okay. Um, would you say that if one of your best friends won, you would do that to them? Like, totally ruin their reputation, like, smash on them and make them, like, totally destroyed? Yeah, pretty much. Um, if they did something to, like, really screw this up. Like, if they, like, try and, like, beat me and, like, be all like, oh, like, Taylor sucks on their campaign, don't vote for her. Then I'm going to smash their reputation and, like, they'll never want to come back to school again. But I would only do that if it, like, really involved me, like, winning or something really, like, awful that they did. But other than that, they're my best friends, so I could never. Right. Yeah. We're here with Rebecca Schaefer, solid D student at Larking Fields High School, and um, literally nothing else worth noting. So, Rebecca, are you excited for prom? Yeah. Uh, care to elaborate on that? At all? Wait, what does elaborate mean? To talk more? I like talking, yeah, I'm good at it. 
but about this particular subject? Oh, um, I'm excited. <laughs> Great, I think we've said enough for this one, thank you. We're here with Brittany Wheeler, the only one worth mentioning in the Golden Trio because she is the only one with a discernible personality. I still hate you. Um, anyway, what are your feelings about prom tonight? Well, I'm super excited and like, I like obviously like know like I'm gonna like win because like Rebecca's like she's good and all but like Taylor's just like she says I'm like so like salty but like she's really salty and you know what ring ring the ocean called they want their salt back like anyway do you think that you're gonna win duh like did you hear what I just said Anyway, so would you say that Taylor is your actual friend, or do you just hang on to her because she's popular and you have nothing left in your life worth clinging to? Well, she's actually not that popular. I am. I think she's really my friend because I'm the popular one. Right. So, if you do become prom queen, are you going to drop Rebecca and Taylor, or are you going to keep being friends with them? I'll probably keep Rebecca. Uh, not sure about Taylor. No. Do you hate her? Yeah, basically. And Rebecca, is she just kind of like, like a pet? Like the kind of puppy that you would just drag around because it's cute and adorable and innocent? Well, not exactly. She's actually nice, smart, kind of. I'm sorry, she's smart? That um, might be a bit of a stretch. Yeah, I'm just saying that because, like, aren't I supposed to be honest? Oh, that's true. You're right, you're right. Wouldn't want any honesty on camera. I'm down to prom one hour, 57 minutes, no. and things are deteriorating quickly. <sighs> without. I didn't ask for your input, but I was going to go with that. Oh, anyway. well, you don't care, sweetie. Um, does this look good on you? It, it's, it's upside, upside down. down. Oh. Why would you make her look? You're so rude. I didn't. I was gonna let her do it by herself. Much better. Did I do good? Yes. Perfect. You did it. Okay. Um, girls, would you mind if you left the room for a moment? Would you mind if you left the room for a moment so I could have some time with God and pray for His guidance and and um just His uh in, in this very important time and um. Uh, Time in my life and, and, and milestone. Sure, honey, man. We look praying to God. Do you want me to leave? No. Um, but everything you're about to tape is confidential. Okay. This is never getting. Do you want me to cut it out afterwards? Um, well, and this documentary is just going to us? Right, of course. Now, I happen to know that Brittany is slightly allergic to vanilla extract. So, if I put some of this warm vanilla sugar perfume into her drink, that vanilla extract, along with any type of perfume in your drink, will give you a tummy ache. Oh my god, are you going to kill her? No, I said slightly allergic. She just... Wait, 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 wait. what are going to be the effects of this? The effects of this? Yeah. Is that probably my greatest competition isn't going to be able to um, attend prom. Also, a little bit of this on me can't hurt. Have you done this before? You seem like you've done this before. Have you, You've done this before, haven't you? Um, I've been... Uh, Salty and slightly cruel if I see some competition or someone willing to overtake my popularity. But, um, not this exactly. You know what? I'm just here to make the documentary. Go ahead. All better. Perfect. Um, I mean, can't hurt her too much, right? Just a little bit of tummy ache. Maybe she won't be able to attend prom. Nothing awful. You're a terrible friend, you know that. I'm not a terrible friend. I just want the best for her. And I don't want her to be heartbroken when I win anyway. So if she's not there, it won't be as depressing. 